from relativism to the connection between reason and religion, Benedict XVI moved hearts through the mind. Aside from his impressive list of books and encyclicals, his nearly eight-year pontificate also had some fun, quirky moments that are often overlooked. Without a doubt, his visit to Mexico was marked by this sombrero. As the Pope made his way through the crowds in the Pope Mobile, he decided to put it on as thousands cheered him on. The crowd loved it and the Pope didn't seem to mind. When it comes to gifts, Benedict XVI received everything from the moving, the spiritual, and the downright odd. That includes this 440-pound Easter egg given to him by the president of Bulgaria. It's made of steel and covered in ruby stones. Perhaps it's not very practical, but it's definitely eye-catching. The president of Ferrari gave the Pope this steering wheel as a gift. What followed was a quick but funny conversation. <laughs> when the circus was in town, it made it a point to perform for Benedict XVI. After seeing the show in the Vatican's Paul VI audience hall during a weekly general audience, the Pope also got to pet a lion cub. It wasn't the first time he'd seen a wild animal up close. Years later, before his trip to Cuba, he got to meet a baby alligator from Cuba that had been smuggled into Europe. Even though he was growing older himself, as Pope, Benedict XVI visited an elderly home to encourage its residents to live with joy. The visit was part of the European Year for active aging and solidarity between generations. As Benedict XVI addressed the group, he reminded them that being elderly is beautiful. He also went to the other end of the spectrum by meeting with a group of young children. The questions were endearing and the Pope's answers were relatable for any age. La mia catechista, preparandomi al giorno della prima comunione, mi ha detto che Gesù è presente nell'Eucaristia. Ma come? Io non lo vedo. <laughs> sì, non lo vediamo, ma ci sono tante cose che non vediamo e che esistono e sono essenziali. Per esempio, non vediamo la nostra ragione, tuttavia abbiamo una ragione. Non vediamo la nostra intelligenza, e la abbiamo. Non vediamo con una parola la nostra anima e tuttavia esiste e vediamo gli effetti perché possiamo parlare, pensare, decidere, eccetera. Anche non vediamo per esempio la corrente elettrica e tuttavia vediamo che esiste. So in nearly eight years as Pope, Benedict XVI definitely left his mark, even before he made history.